Hello, this is a brand new Foric Upright 122 piano that's just come into stock. Foric have a choice of two fittings. This one's got brass pedals and, and brass fittings. And the one alongside it here has got chrome fittings, which uh, so both are popular really, and obviously that's a choice you can make, but for me it's the quality of the piano that really counts. Now when I test the piano, I I often go to the tenor area because on top quality makes of new piano tenors vary slightly so playing this area here I was particularly impressed by the depth of the tone here's the one alongside it this is actually made in 2017 it's obviously got a good tone but somehow the the depth and the the mellowness of the tone of the other one let's have another listen so the mellowness here preciseness of the tone I really enjoy that this is also a top quality piano this is a German Hoffman and a smaller piano and a, 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 a less strong tone extremely mellow this sound now of course the melody area here which uh, you're playing mostly just above middle C is the most important by that I mean it's the one you play the most so you're going to want to that to sing out. So here's the other Feuerich. So it's a beautiful piano too, but there's some an edge on the one that we just tried. Let's go back to that again. And just sing so beautifully. Now we've made plenty of videos with Foric 122s and other Foric pianos, but uh, just uh, it's a long time since I've done one, so just refreshing a few things really. The tone is obviously the most important thing, and of the touch, we'll look at the touch in a second. And around the break point here, there's a tremendous evenness. We've talked about evenness of tone on break points before. And here too, superb. <laughs> Now that's as good as any traditional German upright, and that's not an exaggeration, it's tremendous break point, and tremendous bass tone here. And I said before that the bass strings around this area are actually longer than the Yamaha U3, and certainly this is a, posi a musician's choice very often nowadays, it is the 48122. So that's a new four upright piano coming to stock. Just a few things to do that even the key weighting out. The key weighting is slightly uneven here and there. Um, four it normally plus or minus two grams is what they managed to achieve. There's 48 here, so that's fine for middle C. 44 is a bit low for, for this C here. So bottom C, that's 44 grams and gradually going down with 44 grams on. Um, so that should be raised to about 48 grams or maybe slightly more. Of course it's a personal thing how heavy you want the touch to be but that would be the normal touch for 48 grams would be normal perhaps 50 52 and there's middle C just going down nicely with 48 grams apart from that there's a very small amount of voicing I marked to be on this uh, E flat here it's a bit brighter especially when played loud I was particularly impressed by the evenness on the break point. Um, that's the point at which the strings cross over. So that's one side, that's the other side. And top manufacturers managed to match that very well. And such a rich tenor here. And very warm. And the treble break, again, not always well matched on new pianos. So that's one side, that's the other side. Another thing was, uh, I noticed that the front edges of the keys here uh, a little bit sharp. If you play an octave, you can just feel it a little bit too much on your hand. So that's just filing a, bit, a little bit more on the corners there. Something that's quite common that we have to do. So that's a brand new Foric 122 upright piano. Um, and 
arrived in tune, actually four beats sharp, which is wonderful because with new pianos the strings tend to stretch a bit, so that's excellent. In fact, in every way, I'm so happy with this piano. Just the tone of the notes makes you want to play them individually. such a warm sound and the touch is exquisite it just needs evening out slightly and there's a few small tasks to do on the piano but I'm so pleased with the piano generally if you're interested please do write to us in robertspianos.com I honestly can say you won't get a better new piano uh, uh, certainly this price range anyway and really uh, it competes very well with pianos that are a lot dearer. So thank you very much for listening. <laughs>